Jesus, I'll never forget what you've done for me. Jesus, I'll never forget how you set me free. Jesus, I'll never forget how you brought me down. Jesus, I'll never forget no Tell me how can I forget what you've done for me? How can I forget how you set me free? How can I forget how you brought me out? How can I forget no Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord. Truly, it is a good day, a good day to serve the Lord. Amen. Amen. And this is truly the day that the Lord has made, and let us rejoice and be glad in it. Amen. Amen. I know summer is not over, uh, but you know this is a couple of a few days that are strange in the world, and it's a good day. Amen. It's a nice, nice summery days out there. So, Amen. you know, uh, get out. Do what you can do. Yeah, <laughs> Let the uh, sun hit your face. Or, you know, it, it gives you, uh, opens up your endorphin, make you happy. Yeah, <laughs> yes, Thank you, Lord. So let us pray one for another that uh, the Lord will continue to bless us, bless men and women and children everywhere, that the Lord himself will continue to save and add to the church daily, Amen. such as should be saved. And uh, let us uh, remember Christian ministries. Uh, in a special way. Thank you, Lord, all those that are in position and all those that are uh, members that are coming and attending. Thank you, Lord. Uh, let us uh, pray that we stick together in unity and in love, that the Lord will continue to bless us and build us up. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. And, and that we'll hold on uh, that so that we won't be shaken uh, by any means. Amen. Amen. Uh, pray for the uh, success of the Bible study on tonight. That's something to be said and done to encourage us, to inspire our hearts. Amen. That will help us to uh, cleave unto the Lord. The Bible tells us to cleave unto the Lord with a purpose in heart. Amen. So we have, a, have to have a purpose in our minds of why we are cleaving unto the Lord. Why are you here? Why are you uh, on the Lord's side? Amen. Thank you. We've got to have a reason. Amen. Amen. And the reason, and the reason to wake up in the morning yes. and to do what you do. Amen. Amen. People that don't have a reason are like drifters. Wow. Thank you, Lord. They go to and fro doing whatever. Wow. Thank, you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. So but we ought not like not like ought not to be like that. Amen. Amen. Uh, any other particular prayer requests? Yeah. All right, we'll remember your nephew in a special way. Amen. Remember to stay there. Yeah. All right. We certainly will remember her. You know how she's doing? All right. Mm -hmm. Bishop, I just want to pray for this country. It, basically, there's a lot of stuff floating around on the internet. <coughs> yeah. Some of it true, a lot of it not true. Right. But I think it's getting people riled up for what's right. coming in the election. And you know what? Yeah. If anything, it's going to be people creating it for themselves, I mm -hmm. think, for the most part. Yes. They don't believe in that devil. Absolutely. Yeah, that's one of the enemy's avenues. That he yeah. uses yeah. That to stir up trouble and confusion. That's right. Yes. <laughs> wars and rumors of wars. Yeah. 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 That's, that's the thing. And every evil work. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. All right. Any other particular prayer requests? Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. as the church to stand. Thank you, Lord. And let every heart pray, O oh, gracious Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we come before you, Lord. We just say thank you. 
We praise you for your grace, your mercy, your love, and your kindness. We thank you, Lord, for your multitude of blessings that you bestowed upon us. We thank you, Lord, for making ways where it seemed to be no ways. For opening up our hearts and our minds, Lord. For giving us a mind to come out to the house of prayer, to the house of the Lord. We pray, Lord, that you would bless each and every request that's been made known. Remember men and women and children everywhere, Lord. Hallelujah. Remember those that have had procedures, Smith. We ask you to bless in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Bless our children, Lord. Bless those. Hallelujah. That are seeking your peace. Bless the Lord. Yes, Lord. And we pray against the hand of the enemy. Bless in the Lord. name of Jesus, his plots and his schemes. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord. We pray, Lord, for strength. We pray for unity. We Thank pray you, for Lord. Lord. Yes. We pray for your power. We pray for your anointing. Yes. And Father, we ask you, Lord, that you would send forth an anointing on this day. Yes. Hallelujah. Captivate our hearts and our minds. Hallelujah. Our spirit and our soul. Thank Lord, you, Lord, we pray that you would send us a rain of word. Yes. Hallelujah. To encourage Hallelujah. us, to strengthen us. Hallelujah. As we journey on yes. in the name of Jesus. Open up our Thank understanding. You, Jesus. Hallelujah. Let the understanding of our eyes be enlightened. Yes. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Lord. We pray that you would have your way. Thank you. Uh, have your way, Lord. Jesus, that you would have your way, Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. That you'll be glorified and magnified. In the name of Jesus. In the name of and Jesus. And Father, we give you glory, honor, and all the praise. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Hallelujah. God is good. Hallelujah. Can't nobody do you like Jesus. No amen. amen. Can't nobody do you like the Lord. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. And we praise, we praise the Lord uh, once again. I know I've already said it. Thank you, Lord, but you can't say it enough. <laughs> we praise the Lord because he is good yes. to each and every one of us. Amen. Amen. No matter uh, what we're going through, no matter what's happening in our lives, yes. the Lord has our back. Yes. Thank you, Lord. And yes. he knows and he'll bring us out. Yes. Amen. Amen. All we got to do is stick with him. Yes. Amen. Amen. Yes. Stick with the Lord. Right. Call on the name of the Lord. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. That's encouragement right there. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. And we want to uh, go over to the book of St. James. St. James uh, chapter number one. Thank you, Lord. And uh, kind of a continuation of what we preached on, on Sunday. Thank you, Lord. And uh, I want to talk about about the art of being a hearer and a doer of the word, amen, being a, a hearer and a doer of the word. It's necessary that we be hearers and doers of it, and uh, I'm pretty sure that we can all agree on that, because <laughs> word, word says that. <laughs> so, you know, that settles all, should settle all the speed. <laughs> Thank you, Lord, yes. of, of, of the importance of it. And uh, James, he really lays out an art to it. Uh, it's one thing to know what you should do, but it's another thing to know how to do it. Right. Amen. It's a whole totally different thing. Amen. Amen. Uh, Amen. So you got to know it. You got to know how to do it. Amen. And it first starts out with why. Why? Why should I hear and obey God's word. Why? And I'm putting that out as a question uh, to us. You know, no right or wrong answers. But why should I hear God's word and be a doer? Why? So much easier. Make, make your life easy. Amen. He said his yoke is easy and his burden is light. Make your life easy. Amen. That's one of the reasons why. God said that he gave them his commandments. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. So that yeah. he could, they could live and have a prosperous life. Amen. Right. Amen. Whatever. Whatever. My brother. Uh -oh. Hallelujah. Whatever God speaks to us, that it, to us personally, that's his will for our life. All right. And if we don't obey that, then we're, we're not in, we're no longer operating in his will. Uh-huh. And why is it important to operate in the will of God? want to be pleasing unto him. Uh -huh. you know, he said we, we serve him. Want to please him. him. Amen. Please him. Serve him. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. That's it. My sister, yes, speak up. You got people listening to you. Well, the Bible says that 
Yeah. That's why it's important. So you can be on the path that is given that is designed for you. Yes. And and being on that path, it sanctifies you. Mm -hmm. Amen. It sanctifies you. That path of righteousness. Mm -hmm. It sanctifies you. And that word sanctification deals with separation. Mm -hmm. It sets you apart. Yeah. My sister, Sister Yolanda. tells us then the, the, the high importance that God puts on one doing his will. Mm -hmm. right. he, looks at, he looks at that as transgression, mm -hmm. right. uh, disobedience. Yeah. 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 So he, he looks upon it very high. Right. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. It's on, a, on a scale of one to ten, it's a ten. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. Sister David, yeah. when we obey God, shot, we show our love for him. Ooh. The Bible says, if you love me, you'll obey your yeah. commandments. Mm -hmm. So it shows love. It's not about what God can do for us, what we can do for God. Mm -hmm. It shows how much we love him, that we want to do, we want to obey him. Yeah. For all of the blessing that he bestows upon us. Yes, yes. yes. It's a sign of affection. Yes. Uh, it's a huge sign right. uh, of love and commitment mm -hmm. uh, unto the Lord. Yes. Amen. He said, if you, like she said, if you love me, you'll do what? Keep my, word. Keep my commandments. And then, notice, he said, my commandments then are not grievous. Right. You know, you don't, you don't look at it as a chore. Right. Right. Uh, right. Serving God. It's right. not, oh, I got to serve God today. <laughs> Glad to do it. Amen. Glad to do it. Glad to do it. Oh, I felt that. It was something else couple of places where I put asterisks, but I think we're, what you're talking is um, James here, it looks like 21, where it says, make you perfect in every good work to do his will, working in you that which is well-pleasing in his sight through Jesus Christ, to whom be the glory forever and ever. Uh-huh. Amen. Amen. And that's true. Uh, when we focus on being a hearer and a doer, we are actually accomplishing the will of God. Amen. What he has put you here for. Amen. Because uh, we all have an assignment on our lives. Uh, you're not just here to be here. Uh, you're here to serve God. That's why I like it when the, uh, when the apostles, when they're writing their uh, epistles, they say, even James, he says, James, a servant of God uh, and, and our Lord Jesus Christ, right. you know, and, and therefore being a servant, uh, a servant does the will of the master. Yeah. Right. Uh, so you got to be able to hear what the master wants you to do, and then you got to be willing to do it. Yeah. Amen. With a grateful heart. Amen. Amen. With a grateful heart. With love in your heart. Yes. Amen. Uh, and then 